Folks, this is Wayne Hart, back with another lesson and an absolute classic as always today, the Eagles and Take It Easy. Uh, always reminds me of my dad this one, we always had it on in the car, but uh, I don't think it had the same effect travelling on the M6, uh, you know, when it should be Route 66, I don't think it's quite got the same effect. But absolutely love this song, uh, it's quite a fast one to play, but really easy chords, great one to sing and play, you know, open mics or... Uh, if you're a solo artist or even in a band, you know, great, great song. So uh, without further ado, let's get to it. Okay, so the song is in standard tuning. And first of all, we'll go over the intro. We need a G chord for two bars. Now, you notice I'm doing the four-fingered G. Uh, doesn't really make a big difference, but I just think for this particular song, that G sounds a little bit fatter. So we've got the G. And then we've got a C. D. So that's going to repeat. We've got the G, C, D, and then we're going to hold on the G. So into the verse. Well, I'm a running down the road, trying to loosen my load. Got seven women. Then we got a D and a C on my mind. Back to the G. For the one that owe me, D, C, and mine. Okay. So basically what we want for the verse, that's going to be a G, we're going to change into a D, a C, a G, D, C, G. Okay, so I'm just going to sing that through again. So from the top with the intro, here we go, so we've got the G. So then we're into the chorus, so now we're going to use an E minor. So we've got an E minor, a C going into a G. So we've got a take it easy, take it C to a G. And we're going to go to an A minor. The sound of your own C, drive your E minor. Then to a C, back to a G, and then a C. And an A minor to C Back to the G chord. Okay, so then we've got uh, another verse Which is pretty much identical to the to the last verse We've got another chorus um, So I'll just sing the next chorus through Just so we can see how those chords gel together Come on baby There's a slight difference with this uh, chorus You've got an E minor going into a D then a C and a G. So I'll just sing that through just so you can see how that sort of gels together. Come on, baby, don't say baby. I got to know if your sweet love is gonna save me. We may lose, we may win, we'll never be here again. So Okay, so then we've got uh, an instrumental, so we've got a G for two bars, it's and then it's got a G, D, C, G, D, C, G. We go to an E minor, D, C, G, A minor. 
meine, sie hat eine wie meine, wie meine, die will I'm a running down. So we're back then back into verse 3. Uh, so the verse is the same. Uh, the last chorus is the same as chorus 1, so we don't put that E and D in. We just got take it easy, take it easy, just a straight C to the G. Knowing the sound of your own wheels drive you crazy. Okay, so now we've got this outro that sort of goes around four times, and that is a C for two bars and a G. On the last time round, on the fourth time round, we're going to go from a C and finish on an E minor. So I'll just play that through. We've got the C. Oh, 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 Yeah, so the C and the G, I think it was, I said three times originally. It's actually four times that goes round. And then on the fifth time, we do a C for two bars and we'd finish on the E minor. And that is pretty much uh, the meat and potatoes of the song. So that just leaves us with a strumming pattern. Now, I think it's quite effective what, you, what I did in the intro. So uh, on my intro, on the intro and the song, okay? So I think it's quite effective to do downstroke. So on the G, we've got... And a little flip there, so see that quick flip there. And on the G, the little build up to the um, the first verse, I think it's nice to. If we just bring the second finger down to the third fret on the A string, just a nice little embellishment. Okay, so when we get into the verse and pretty much, you know, the rest of the song, I think it's quite effective. Down, down, up, down, up, down, up. To go half a time, it would just be a down, down, up. So we've got a running down the road, trying to do some battle. Because down, 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 and that is pretty much all you're going to need. Okay, so thanks very much for watching. Hope you all dug that. Uh, and I think that's one of those songs, if you don't like that, you don't like music. It's an amazing song. And uh, I think as I get older, I appreciate the Eagles more and more. I think when I was young, it was always, you know, sort of dad's music. It was something my dad always listened to. But I, I really, really get the Eagles now. Uh, but I, as I said in the intro, I don't think he's got the same effect driving up and down the M6s. Probably what it would have driving up and down Route 66. Uh, I, I don't know. I just think uh, the surroundings are a little bit different and it doesn't quite fit the song. But, but there you go. Still great to listen to in a car. So I uh, hope you all enjoyed that. If you got any other requests for uh, not just Eagles songs, anything in particular, 60s to modern day, a lot of you know the drill now. You can either comment in the post below or a good way to reach me these days on social media. So on Wayne Our Guitar on Facebook, Twitter and now also Instagram. And I'd appreciate it if you gave me a follow on those uh, platforms anyway, but that way you can send me a personal message and I do always try and reply to messages. Uh, just got to respect to get hundreds of requests. Uh, so I do sort of have to hemp hit them a little bit, but please do keep them coming. That's what keeps this channel going. 
Uh, thanks everyone who subscribed. As always, really means a lot. Uh, you know, thank you so much. I'm getting some great messages, and if you're not already subscribed, you know, please do. One thing that you could help me out with is the little notification bell down there. So you're going to get notified every time I post a video, which is either once, twice, sometimes three times a week, just lately. Uh, and that way you can keep on top of songs and, uh, you know, and another way that you could help me out, because I think word of mouth is a very powerful thing. So if you want to tell your friends about me who've just recently just started playing a guitar or maybe someone who's been playing a guitar for a few, few years and maybe needs a little bit of inspiration, um, you know, with some great songs to learn, you know, point them in my direction. So that just leaves me to say have a great morning, day, night, whenever it is you're watching, and I'll catch you all for a lesson very soon. Take care.